COVID cases are a concern in our schools. This week, Ontario's Medical Officer of Health said that rapid tests are handed out every week to students. Though many parents have reached out to us saying that simply isn't true. So we went out today to try and set the record straight and uncover the truth. Running through the spring sun, a simple joy for children following another difficult, dark COVID winter. With the pandemic still present, the one tool being used to monitor the health of kids and their families, rapid antigen tests. Though just how many tests are being sent home remains cloaked in confusion. We definitely have not been receiving uh, weekly rapid tests coming home to us. Kate Dupuy is a neuropsychologist and a mother of two. Her seven-year-old daughter attends public school in Toronto. So we've gotten seven rapid tests in total since uh, December of 2021. City News spoke with parents from every corner of the province today where we heard a similar story. Their children have only received between five to seven tests since the Ontario government began making them readily available through schools before the winter break. I just don't really know what to say anymore as a parent. It's it's very frustrating. Speaking yesterday, the province's medical officer of health was asked if he's considering following Public Health Ontario's recommendation to temporarily reintroduce masks in school settings. In part, he defended his decision not to by making this claim about rapid tests. Uh, use the RATs, uh, those tests that are distributed on a weekly basis to all students across Ontario. The messaging around rapid tests has always been so confusing. In an effort to clear up the confusion, City News travelled to Whitby today to ask Ontario's Minister of Health. Do you believe that rapid tests are distributed on a weekly basis to students across Ontario? Well, perhaps I can clarify that. There are 7 million tests a week that are being distributed to local school boards, and school boards will then determine to which schools those tests should be sent. However, that's not exactly accurate either. Following the press conference, Minister Elliott's staff informed City News that the province is distributing 7 million rapid tests a month, not each week. In the end, we were able to get an answer. Okay, so I think that's a note. So they're not, they're not necessarily going to every student uh, yes. each week. The Toronto District School Board adding additional clarity, confirming that the board delivers tests every two weeks to schools. Staff only hand them out if a student is symptomatic. Multiple frontline healthcare workers and doctors have been clear. They believe rapid tests are essential to containing the virus. This week's rapid test communication confusion, adding another layer of frustration for flabbergasted families. I don't know why this is so hard. The federal government has provided over 160 million rapid tests to Ontarians. We all paid for these tests through our taxes. It should be really, really easy for us to get access to these tests on an ongoing basis two years into the pandemic. And an update we, to a story we brought you last night now with uh, trustees in Ottawa, Hamilton and Halton all set to vote to reintroduce masks in those schools, in those cities and regions. Minister Elliott today telling me that they should wait for further guidance from Dr. Moore, though he's already said he doesn't plan on reintroducing masks anytime soon.